could be if the strut came loose again. On the driver's side, the strut bolt came completely out and fell out. And the bottom of the strut was banging on the knuckle. I went to the junkyard, got a new bolt. This time when I put the bolt in, I used blue Loctite. And I noticed one day that it was making a little bit of a noise. So I go under there and I check and I can see the bolt has backed out slightly. So I get under there and just crank it down and I haven't had an issue. So I'm wondering if when I did the brake job and I took off the strut, if I just didn't tighten it enough or maybe if I just need to put Loctite on again. That is if the strut is even the issue because I really don't think it is. I don't know how it could have made that noise. So I'm not sure what's up with this guy. So I use my signal for a few seconds. I'm already in the lane. I'm in the lane for at least a second or two before he decides, you know what, I don't want him to pass the truck. And he tries to go in front of me so I can't pass. And then he just gets really mad.
190,090 miles. Yeah, Roy's 350Z was the first manual transmission I did drive, but truly I learned in this car. I went from not really being able to move very much to like just driving this car. I think the night I got this car, I just drove it for like two or three hours. I don't mean like I just put it in fifth gear and I drove around the town that I lived in. So I really got that like 